So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add an app. It is a size chart. Let's visit the app store. We're just going to type in size chart. And if we scroll down a bit, I believe it's this one, size matters. It's completely free. That's why we're using it. And we're going to hit add app. We're going to just hit install app. The next thing you're going to do is just go to apps on the side here and hit your size matters hassle free size chart. And then what it'll do is it'll give you an option to install this app. And it's not going to show us because our store is not open yet, but what you want to do is install this app automatically. In page is fine, position one is fine, and just check that and hit install. All right, so let's leave this open. I'm going to right click and open a new tab here for apps. I'm going to go to my apps and I'm going to go back to a Burlo. I'm going to view my products. And remember, these are the products we have in the store. And we're going to open them in the AliExpress. So open original up here. And it's going to show us this. Now, what we're looking for here is the size chart, which we just saw. Here it is. So we're going to go back to the size chart, hit create new size chart, and we'll title it something like, uh, we'll just put size chart, like it says here. And then the tag is going to be bikini. We'll hit enter. So everything tagged with the word bikini, this size chart will show up on. And then down here, we add the size chart. So it looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and four. So four uh, rows and six columns. So we're going to go back to here. We can close some of these. And here you can see it just hovers like this. So you can click add and there's four rows. And then we'll do columns to and six columns. And we're just going to copy this chart exactly. Let's bring it over here. So I'm sure you notice this already. These sizes are in centimeters. That's European sizes or pretty much the rest of the world. Uh, but since we're selling to America, uh, what I would recommend doing is actually converting all of these to inches. I'm not going to do that in this video. You guys can do that. Just go online, look up a online conversion and convert them properly. This is a sample store, so for the sake of this, I'm not going to do that. But you guys can do that, or you could leave it this way, whatever. So once you're done with the chart, we're just going to hit Save here. And then when we go to our products, let's make sure our products are tagged with the word bikini. So we can go to Products, All Products, check the box here, More Actions, and hit Add Tags. and hit bikini. So let's hit save. Now all of our products should be saved with the word bikini. All right, so we're actually going to have to do a small bit of coding just to install this app. So if you go to the help section on this size matters app, it'll tell you step by step instructions how to install the app. But we're going to go ahead and do it together because it does require a little bit of coding. So here's the code we need. Inline is just going to show you the size chart just in the description. Pop-up is you have to click on a little link like something that says size chart and then it'll pop up with the size chart and then this is of course a button instead of a link and it'll pop up with the size chart. So I'm gonna do inline because I just want it to be in my description. So I'm gonna copy this code and then right up here you're gonna hit open section product template and you're just gonna click continue here. And so we have to find the right spot we want this code to be in. So here's all your code for the product template. And we're just going to scroll down and I'll show you exactly where it needs to be. All right, so we're going to scroll down and this is actually exactly where you want it to be. So right after it says div class product single description. So you want to look for this product description. And a fast way you could do it is just command or control F 
and it'll bring up this little search bar and you can just type in a uh, description and it'll give you everything that says description and you're just going to keep keep clicking this arrow down until you get to this one product dot description and then right after this div here you're going to hit enter make a little space for your code copy your code in there and hit save and that should be it now you'll want to test this so what you're going to want to do is go to back to your products let's open them up in a new tab and right here the eyeball you hit the eyeball and it'll show you the product and if you did it correctly your size chart should be right here just below your description so we really need to clean this page up but uh, here's your description and here's your size chart so now people can see the sizes of all your stuff and this will only show up for your products that are labeled with the word bikini so one of the reasons I really like this size chart is because you can add text above and below your chart and it can be an HTML format so what this means is you can add text to every single one of your product descriptions without having to manually go into each product and add that text. I'll give you an example of what the text should be. You should always have some sort of guarantee in your product description inside each of one of your products. So when someone's on the product page, they see your product, they see the product's description, and then they see maybe the size chart. And then after all of that, it says, this is our store's guarantee. And it says like 30 day money back guarantee, satisfaction guaranteed, real life human contact. Uh, and then maybe you can add like an image with, uh, you know, we have secure checkout with Visa and MasterCard and PayPal and all this stuff. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So I've actually made this really easy for you guys. I have the code for you guys to download in the resources tab down below, and it's just the size chart code. And what you're gonna do is copy and paste this code right in here, below table. So go back to your size chart, go to dashboard, click on uh, your size, your bikini size chart, and then right in the below tab here, you're just gonna hit paste that code. and the thing the only thing you need to change is there's a spot right here and you could just copy that and put your store name in so mine i guess for now is okie pride you could put your store in there and it just says you know our guarantee if you don't have a great experience we will make it right 100 percent satisfaction guaranteed there's absolutely zero risk buying from okie pride your store uh, just send us an email if you need assistance and then it has this code and it makes these bullet points and stuff and then it has an image attached here so if you hit save and you go back to your product page and we'll reload it just take a look at your product page you'll see your size chart loaded here so it was placed below the size chart so here's the size chart and then below that is our guarantee and you see all of this and that's what it looks like and then here is the image as well guaranteed secure checkout so you guys can find this code this is what it added and it'll add it to everything that's tagged with the bikini so you don't have to type it in every time so you guys can find that code in the resources tab below and of course guys if you have multiple products you're gonna want to make a new size just create new size chart and just do the same thing we did or you could duplicate this one since it's already has the code in there but you could duplicate it and just go in here and just remake the size chart make sure you add a different tag for whatever product you're doing next time and go ahead and change all this hit save and you'll have yourself a second size chart so that's it for installing size chart super helpful app completely free and it the best thing about it, not only is it great for clothing sizes, I would still install it even if you're not selling something that needs a size chart because it allows you to add a description to every single one of your products without manually going into the description of every single one of your products. You could just type in whatever you want on every page in that 
bottom or top below and just leave the chart blank. So that's it for size chart. Let's go on to the next step.